Wins. This one's got the inside track. And Georgia will work from the 25 yard line. And they do have Zamir in there too, so a full house backfield. And here is Zamir White. And Zamir White down the sideline might have a touchdown of 75 yards. Georgia leads 6 0. Whoa, what a way to start things off. Well, somebody has to get from Florida on the outside of the formation and turn it back in, and nobody did. Right here, I think the safety. Brad Stewart, number two, has to get outside. Turned in by the corner, but that's too far out. Too big of a gash. A nice shift, and give that formation change when they shift it and ready for it. Todd Munkin with a great scheme for a start of a foot. In the Georgia backfield, high snap on the rollout. It's a keeper all the way for Bennett. He's got good wheels, and he's got about 12 yards on the Georgia first down. Moon and Cox at the defensive end spot. James Cook out of the backfield, makes the grab, and Cook's got a first down before he's run out. Bennett down the middle. On the run to Marcus Rosme St. John, and he's got the touchdown. Hurt at the end, I think. Maybe the receiver and the quarterback took one. It was a late disguised safety blitz. He was free for Florida, but he didn't get there. He was so deep on the play, he never got there. That was the breakdown. Coming from the backside, right in, too late to get there from the slot. Free run at the quarterback, Bennett, but Rose Ooh. Murray, Jack Saint for the touch. Up and good. Georgia has second and ten. They'll keep it on the ground this time. Pierce reverses his field. Nice run. First down uh, across the 35. Yeah, busted play right here. Defended well by the Georgia. The sun is trying to come back out while the rain drops. So does Kyle Trask. And the throws on the money. Down the sideline. Zipper. And a big play for the Gators. Trask in trouble. Lofts one across the middle. Got it on the run. Got it to Shorter for the touchdown. Justin Shorter scores for the Gators. So interesting. When I told you they opened up the game last year with the slant to Pitts. This is the same exact formation. They're going to motion away from Pitts to run the slant. But this time, Kyle Trask says no. I think you're waiting for it. I'm coming back the other direction. In for the point after. Snaps a little high. They got the hold down and the kick is up in hands yet today. They keep it on the ground at Davis. He's got a first down up to the 32. Trask down the sideline. Got it to Davis. First down as he's too better. They'll keep it on the ground and they'll get the first down so they don't run as Tony in motion. They fake it to both of them, and now deep on the sideline for Pitts, and he makes a catch. Kyle Pitts, first and goal, Florida. Pierce, straight up the middle, touchdown, Gators. We're an extra point away from a tie game in Jacksonville. Well, you got to believe that Georgia defense is looking all over. Where's 84? Where, where's number one? And all of a sudden, while they're looking around, boom, they're running right at you, and they make the touchdown. Good call. Remember team that rushes for more yards and this one is one go from there and then number one who goes that way with him Tony Trask a little uneasy but he got it complete to shorter who has a touchdown third package in Florida goes fast Trask in third and ten and it is intercepted picked off Eric Stokes for Georgia coming back the other way and he's got a convoy Stokes touchdown Georgia A ball intended for Xavier Henderson and Eric Stokes with his third interception of the year, his second touchdown return of the year. I don't know if it was who it was intended to, but watch Stokes come off his man. He's on Xavier Henderson. I think he's throwing it to Tony, and he actually goes and picks it off. Sometimes when you go fast, 
you're not ready. And I didn't think Florida was ready. They didn't have a good room, really saw the defense in front of them. Extra point is up towards the ball and the quarterback. Full speed. He is a real route. Naquan right down the sideline for Florida. Georgia with a blitz. Trash going to the end zone. Pitts. Touchdown. My goodness. Tyson Campbell was trying to stay with a big fella, but too much. You want to know how college football has changed? That's how college football has changed. You've got guys that were six foot six basketball players now playing tight end. Pass interference. Defense. Number three. That penalty you know, is the time. The result of the play. Touchdown. Good in the first four games and, this year. But it, it seems like a 50 50 ball when you throw it, but it's. He's up to 20 touchdown tosses on the year. He's back looking for more. Going deep for more. And he's got it in stride, Malik Davis. And a nine. Trask fires deep middle. Oh my goodness, oh my. Pitts didn't That's make the be. catch, and we're going to have what looks like maybe a targeting call on seam. I think it is. Checks just inside the Georgia 25. Play action for Trask. Going to a wide open. Kimari Gamble. Touchdown, Florida. So, Ness. The conversation we had with Kirby Smart when he said, I'm very confident in the communication of our defense. We shouldn't bust. This is another bust. I mean, one guy goes in motion. For some reason, the Georgia pass. And Florida is in front for the first time. He's going to throw again on a quick slant and got it complete out to the 19. Second and 13. Trask. And he's got a man. Breaking a tackle is Pierce. And Pierce, he's got a big gainer out near midfield. First half. They're down at two. Can Pierce get the first down? He does easily. Monty Rice will bring him down, but not before. He got to add to the floor to lead. And he blasted that one. Sure did. 50 yard field goal. They come on. Oh, no. The previous time, this one. That's going to be inside the 50 yard line, I think, Brad. Short field for Florida with two timeouts remaining. It is. So game. He's in a slot on the left side. Trask back to throw. Throws short and it's going to be three right now. Now they come with some pressure, but the ball goes to the end zone. Touchdown. Trevon Grimes. Oh my goodness. Tyson Campbell was there, but the throw was perfect. The grab maybe even better. Six foot three, Grimes. Remember, he played behind four NFL receivers last year. Gets his chance and make. Remember what this Florida receiving group lost. Van hey, everybody. I'm Wheels. Make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss a video. All right, enjoy the second half highlights. There's 20 completions for 341 yards and looking for more, and he's got. About 15 more complete. First down from the 39, and the RPO is another dart for 13 more to Trayvon Grimes. The eight right now. He's going to try another one. Down the middle, a little bit high, but Tony drags it down anyway. Hasn't missed yet this year. Still hasn't missed. Wow, what a weapon to have. And that, that's again, that's good from 60 in more normal. Bennett looking left the whole time, goes that way. To the right. Nice save. Bennett has time, and it's intercepted. Picked off by Kair Elam. I think Jalen John. Maybe this, and maybe that. And Mathis has a first down. Demir White ordered the quarterback. And it's the quarterback, and he got it this time. Give is to James Cook, looking for a block from his quarterback if he doesn't help hold somebody. And corner blitz coming. Milton on a handoff straight up the middle. And Milton's got it down around the 20 yard line in a Georgia. Mathis. Or get all of it. And he got it. Touchdown, Georgia. Kiaris Jackson.
Well, Florida was trying to disguise so much, they ran right out of the coverage. Watch the disguise, and when he bails, he actually opens up the area behind him. And that's the throw right into the middle of the field. You're trying to fake the quarterback so much, you gave Mathis plenty of time to step into that throw. Trask lofts it out, and again, out of the backfield, they're going to get an easy one for 11. Those free reels. Trask looking for more. That should put him at a career high in passing yardage. And another right comes back in there with him. Here comes the quarterback draw that Gary just talked about. And it's another oh, first play. down. Got Trask gets some pressure from the backside. This one is, well, it is, 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 uh, is tight. McPherson. From 44. Look at Gary. Missed that prognosticator. Yes, he missed it. Missed it from 44. That's a big field. <laughs> <laughs> Here's Trask. In trouble. Got a little pressure on him again, but he still finds his receiver. Yep. And it's Malik Davis out of the backfield. And two in the bottom. Georgia's got to have a stop on third nine. They got some pressure again. Trask throws and completes it to Tony. And he's still going. Tenere. They empty the backfield. They are going to go for it. Trask hit as he throws. Incomplete. Interesting. Aziz Ojolari got in there and three receivers to the left. Mathis flushed, has to just throw on his back foot and hope for a prayer, and he ended up throwing an interception to Sean Davis. And Davis coming back the other way. Davis weaving through traffic inside the 20. And with all the offense Florida's had through the year, their defense might have just iced things. 36. Pierce runs into the Georgia wall defensively. And now his hit from 34. With 119 to go. Also, if not this year, win, right? With the quarterback problems right. that Georgia was having. Mathis fires. This one is intercepted. And that'll ice it as Amari Bernie, the outside linebacker, Picks it off.